I heard that Michael Bay and Will Smith are doing a movie together. Nice. That movie's gonna slap. Josh! Hey, welcome back to our Stupid Racks. I'm Corbin. I'm Michael Bay. You wish. Follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy content. I have a favorite Michael Bay film. Okay. What is it? What is it? It's called 12th Hour or 13th Hour. It's a story about Benghazi. The 13th Hour. It's 13th Hour? Yeah. Why? Have you seen it? Is that the one with uh, Jim? Yep. Yeah. That's a good one. Very. Uh, if you've not seen 13 Hours, it's uh, excellent. If he did the first. Based on a true story about something terrible that happened in Benghazi. Uh, it might be the first Transformers. That one, the first Transformers was really good. That was a really good, especially it was very him as well. But uh, did you ever watch the Transformers? Never saw any of the Transformers. Just watch the first one. Yeah? The first one's good. The first one's good? You don't have to. I think. I think I only saw I the say first I have two. my favorite Michael Bay films. I Bay think I've seen Bay. two. Yeah. No, that's a fun, uh, obviously it spurred a whole bunch of shitty ones, but um, the first one's very good. Yeah, oh, did in fact, he direct, look at his... Did he direct... Oh, he directed Armageddon. Oh, yeah, I know. I have other favorite ones. He's a very established director. Oh, my stars, yes. Uh, bad Boys. Love Bad Boys. I didn't see Bad Boys 2. No, I did see Bad Boys 2. I haven't seen the new Bad Boys. Uh, I love I Bad Boys. I've not seen any of the Bad Boys. Uh, Pearl Harbor. That's a good one, too. Armageddon. I didn't see Pearl Harbor. Didn't see Armageddon. What? Yeah. The fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> Armageddon's like up your alley. What do you? That was like, that was like peak year to nineties. Yeah. What am I? What can I tell you? That's weird, Rick. Okay. So after seeing it, because I always forget what he's directed. It's it's Armageddon. Do you, I, and you said you did see Thirteen Hours or no? Yes, I did. Okay. Very good one. I enjoyed yeah. that one as well. Yeah. But these other ones are just entertainers, man. These are just fun, entertaining movies. Uh, Armageddon actually has a lot of meat on it too. Uh, Who's in that? Everyone, um, um, a lot of people. Bill Bruce Willis, Billy, right? Billy, Billy Bruce Billy, Willis, Billy Bob Thornton, Ben Affleck, Blake Lively. They've worked a lot together. Will Buscemi, Patton, Steve Buscemi, Owen Wilson, Will Fasher, yeah, yeah. I a, did. I did not see Armageddon. You need to. That'd be just fun for you to and try to watch. That's just a good movie. Yeah, <laughs> that's just a very good movie. All right. uh, I can't believe you've never seen that one. Uh, Tabe, you got one of these compilations. That was a uh, really so well. It's the original versus remake. Uh, Hindi songs. Uh, oh, so yeah, it, it's, it's been it's, a while. We've yes, done this. It's doing yeah. like the uh, the original one, song, and, it shows you and then it's a remake. And, so, and which of the two? And it'll be this is the ixo de facto opinion on the matter. Yes. So what we say is better is, is by it? far the better, which is always the case, yeah, isn't yeah. it? Uh, two white guys in a room. Yep. That's uh, that's the you know the end all be all opinion here. Yeah. I hope that's good. What is it? Smile two. Oh, I never saw Smile one. It was good. I don't like smiling. So. Smile, smile was good. Not great, but it was. Uh, we saw it in theaters. Did you ever see Trifer? We enjoyed it. Trifer? No. The one of the new clown kind of horror kind of thing. No, no, no. I have not seen that. I hear it's actually really good. That series is there on the third one. People are walking out of the third, the beginning one because it's so gruesome. Is it? Is it a slasher film? Yeah, slasher films don't necessarily do. No, much but they're saying this one's like a like the most modern supernatural is is what's in Johnny's you can my have a broader ex, you I gotta have a broader opinion of things right if it's an intelligent slasher film sure but if it's oh my just God. the movie's so gross that just doesn't do much it. for me here we go oh yeah we react to that that's right, we reacted to that. I gotta like, I love that deep bass drop, which is technology of today. It's kind of not fair. Is that a hit? No, I like the original. Me too. Does this look original? Oh. Remake. Yeah, remake. Wow. Original. That does sound nice, though. Yeah, that sounded like a J and a tool. No. Original. Original. Original by far. Don't take it away. 
Govinda. Is that crew? It looks like it, yeah. Original. Original. Hey! Where's the water? Yeah, his chest here. Original. Dancing school. Original. It didn't sound that different. Somewhat uh, indiscernible. Sound exactly the same, kind of. Original. Oh. Look at that. Sure. And Drani's aroused. Beefcake. We've seen this one. Original. Nope, original. Nope, original. What is that song? Did crew? Did crew remake every song? It's like every song, like a remake? I liked the original. 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 Yeah! Did Crew remake this too? No, it's not Crew. Original. 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 No. Oh, even though that's nice. And we like that song a lot. They're so different. That's a better vibe, but the freeze was so good. The remake. Remake. Sexy video, too. Original. Original. This feels like it has more soul. Yeah. Did this have an old remix too? I don't like the ones that have two, like two years ago. Oh, the original. <laughs> no, no, original by like not even throw it away. That's the original without question. Original. Did that go Vinda? I think so. No. Oh, I like that. I like the remake. Original. It's hard to say with just five second clips, but. Oh, I love this song. It's gonna be tough to redo this, because I love this song. Sounds the same. It's 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 exactly the same. Shreya. No, give it to the mother. Original. Now. You've never once been on a ranch. No, original. I like that key better. No, original. I like that key. Original. Yeah, original. That's more passionate, yeah. Original. Sounds like it was digitized, it was cleaned up. I like that. I like yeah, I like the it. compression on that. Nope. Original. original. Nope. Immediately. I can tell immediately. Yep. I don't like it.
Ah. Ah. We've seen this one, though. This we, one, I mean... We have seen this one. It's almost like it's not even playing. It's so subtle, both of them. Mm. Yes, uh, yes. Clearly mm. copyright mm. issues. Ah. We, we get it. Original. Yeah. It's going to be hard to beat Kishore Kumar. I'm going to go Kishore Kumar. I think so. I mean, the remake came really close. <laughs> Really, really close. Nope, original. I'll go to the original. We have. Three? What happened there? I don't hate it, but uh, the original. I, I think maybe the remake on that one. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It, it's so difficult. Um, that was pretty good. Um, to tell in like five six seconds, yeah. it just has. It's like a vibe that you just feel immediate. Yeah, and like so. It, it doesn't mean like if we heard the the remake that we would, we wouldn't end up liking it, but obviously just hearing them together, you you're like mm, I just vibe with the first one a little more. Yeah. Um, did crew is all are all crew songs like remakes? It seems like that. And uh, Sanjay's series had I didn't realize his series the the Haramendi had a lot of remakes. Oh know? yeah, uh, it might make sense because I think. Crew was a tips movie, which is a music right house, and so they produced so many '90s songs. They've been around for a long time, and right. some maybe they were just like, "Yeah, we're just gonna use our old music." And maybe, obviously, it's good for business. I guess yeah. people yeah. Are going back to uh, old songs. And I didn't them. realize that that song I like so much. I didn't know that was a remake. Really like that song and that video. Disappointed now. No. No, that doesn't disappoint me. Why? Because remakes don't necessarily disappoint me, as long as it's done well. Is there a, what I don't like is sampling something and writing a completely new song when you've done nothing but take an old song and put new lyrics to but it. Sometimes it's fire. Very rarely. Uh, Nicki Minaj and Anaconda. Yeah, it's very, it, My it can happen. Anaconda don't. That's a <laughs> that is truly a good one. So was can't touch this. Yep. So sometimes it works, but a lot of the times I don't. I don't like it. Like I don't like Gwen Stefani taking uh, "If I Was a Rich Man" and turning that into a oh, contemporary yeah, that was, that thing. Was a piece of shit. Yeah, it didn't work. Uh, so, but it does work sometimes. What was, I, the, what was the last great and for Western music remake? Yeah, remake song. Yeah. Honestly, and I don't think a lot of people have heard it. Beyonce's version of "Blackbird" is gorgeous. And she Blackbird uses she uses no. Paul's original guitar track, and then she puts some vocal arrangements around it that are fabulous. That's that when you take a song as iconic as Blackbird, which is one of the most famous Western songs in the 20th and 21st century, and do something a little bit new to it. I, I, I was and I'm a the Beatles are the top for me, and Paul is the top of the Beatles for me. I it's gorgeous. Do your listen to Blackbird off Beyonce's country album. It's yeah. gorgeous. I know it happens like every single year in, in um, Indian cinema. Just the remakes of yeah. Obviously, I don't I don't know if that will ever die. I think the the remakes of old films is definitely slowing down. From yeah, what it was at least even a few years. Yeah, ago. I think a remake of a song as long as it's done right, like the way Beyonce did Blackbird. People like nostalgia. Uh, like nostalgia, and as long as it's it's done right, I'm not a fan of. Taking a song like right now, there's a T-Mobile ad. I they've taken the song that was written for National Lampoon's Vacation and they've used it for their jingle. I I really have a hard time. I'm happy for the songwriters getting the bank on that. More power to them. But it's rough when I hear a great song that has a memory for me turned into a jingle. Yeah, yeah. I don't care. Also, I don't typically watch things that have commercials at all. No, I don't. I don't have cable outside of. Neither do we. Uh, I have the. Sunday. But we still get ads on some of our subscriptions. We have the ad version of the subscription rather than pay the higher tier for no ads. Uh, so we still get ads. All the ones like on I... on Disney or Hulu. We have Hulu ads, Disney ads. No, I don't. I pay for the better one because I can't stand it. Yeah. Uh, a lot our, of... you, our YouTube TV is. We yeah. get ads on YouTube TV. I, um, 
I I've canceled a lot of those subscription services. Yeah, just because I like, I might cancel Netflix soon. Why? There's we don't watch anything on there. Well, except for there's the not sometimes. much there for kids. That's for sure. Yeah, like the majority of what we watch, no kid's gonna want to watch it. Yeah, Ripley, Shogun, Baby Reindeer. That's not. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, we don't watch a lot. We don't watch a lot on it right now. Yeah. Um, but yeah. Yeah, we watch Netflix, Max, Hulu, Apple. We have YouTube TV. That's our version of our cable That's coverage. The, the only live thing I, I watch, Disney, is football. Yeah, the only. Well, we watch. We occasionally turn on live TV just to see what's on and maybe see something like uh, Whose Line Is It Anyway? Uh, we always watch Dancing with the Stars, but we can get that on YouTube Live or we can get it on Disney. Yeah, no. All postseason baseball I get on YouTube TV. Which, if you're looking for a streaming service for TV, at least here in the states, yeah, it's the best YouTube TV is the best. Yeah, by far. And we're not just saying that because we're YouTubers. They do. They they provide the best options and channels and prices. I, YouTube TV. I wish they paid us. That's yeah. Awesome. <laughs> but I'll, I'll plug YouTube TV all day long. I like them. Yeah, uh, they're much better than Direct TV was with much. Sunday Ticket. Or anybody um, else that offers. There's there's other ones that say they're cheaper, and they, but they have far less channels. Although it's, I am pissed off at the NFL. For? Um, yeah, they switched over from DirecTV. For, they had the Sunday ticket for Right, Sunday decades. ticket disappeared. Um, now they're on YouTube TV. But apparently, Apple had offered lots of money. Oh, yeah. And right. offered a la carte. Oh. So you could have... I, you could make your choices. I still have to buy the full season, so right. it's like two or three hundred dollars or something like that for the full season. Um, of I get you know every single game in the NFL, um, which I need because I can't watch Falcons games here because they're not ever going to show up right, on right. TV. But um, they they wanted to offer at a smaller price, so I could have just bought the Falcons games and it have been like eighty bucks. And they stopped that. And they were like, "No, we don't want that." Like, Go yourself, NFL. Uh... Oh well, that's not. Uh, let's know uh, if there's. I, I did see some songs here I didn't recognize. Yeah, so me too. In the, if there's uh, some that we should react to, uh, please let us know what they are. Please, uh, so we can uh, listen to them in uh, any of your thoughts down below. Josh!